a 4-1 lead with less than a minute left. Now Rust tries to work that for Crosby. Crosby knocks on Chatfield. Chatfield right back at Crosby. Now Latang. Crosby. One touch. Rust shot. Anderson got a piece. Chatfield. Trying to get it on Crosby, another opportunity there. Anderson makes the save, and the Canes try to clear it up. Kept in, Latang, side of the net, Malkin, Crosby, in the slot, hammers one. That's deflected over top of the net, Rust with it. Sent back across, one second left, and this one's over. And the Canes, that wouldn't have counted if it went, win this one, four to one. A iron-type victory in the Steel City. What a save there for Anderson, and you know, you can see that that's the culture of this hockey club right now. They wanted to finish this thing right for Freddie Anderson. Big block from Martin, a huge save from Anderson, just an outstanding performance. We'll go to St. Louis. I think the entire team might want to dye their hair blonde after Natchez's performance tonight. Well, with the two points, the Carolina L House will donate $200 to the Carolina Hurricanes Foundation in the Points for Kids program. With every victory this season, $200 to the foundation. Well, it's opening week for the Hurricanes. Started off with that tough loss against Tampa. But two wins back-to-back -back against Metro Division foes, beating New Jersey on Tuesday. Pittsburgh tonight. Tomorrow we'll be in St. Louis. Well, in the Steel City, you want to show what kind of medal you have. The Canes did just that with a 4-1 win. Coming up after the break, it's Hurricanes Live presented by Lenovo. You'll hear from Rod Brindamore. We'll hear from the player of the game. We'll get trips, three stars of the game, stats, analysis, and we look ahead to tomorrow's faceoff against the St. Louis Blues. Carolina goes to 2-1 on the season with a 4-1 win in Pittsburgh.